everyone, it's Janice. Welcome back. Today I want to share with you guys my favorite products for hair, skin, and makeup that are paraben free. There's a lot of conflicting information out there right now about parabens and there's not a lot of facts. So I'm not here to share with you guys, you know, necessarily my opinion or my stance on one way or the other about if parabens are bad for you or not. I just kind of want to help you out and let you know what products I think are really great that are paraben free. So if you're searching for some products, hopefully I have some good suggestions for you. And if you're not familiar with what parabens are, parabens are basically chemical preservatives that are found in your personal care items and some studies have shown that they have been found in breast cancer tumors but there is not any like direct link or direct evidence that necessarily shows that parabens do cause cancer and one of my favorite youtubers who I really trust on here is Dr. Neil Schultz he's a dermatologist and he has a video all about parabens and basically what he said in his video is that the amount of parabens in the personal care products and in the makeup is so small that when it's absorbed into your body it's not really you know making that much of an impact um, so he basically said that parabens are safe is what he says that's one person's opinion but he is a professional so I just want to put that out there for you um, and what's kind of like more my concern with the parabens though is that I probably use like 30 products a day between the hair care and the makeup and the skin care and if all of those products have a little bit of parabens in them and I use them for like 60 years I'm concerned about what kind of impact that might have on, on my body so lately I have really been trying to find products that I like that are paraben free so here's my very favorite ones and let's just get going into the products and you know whatever you want to choose to purchase for your body is completely up to you um, you have the right to purchase whatever product you want to buy. So I'm not telling you what to do, just sharing with you guys products that I like. So for hair, paraben-free products that I really like is the Moroccan Argan Cream Conditioner. I've used a few different products from this line. This is the Organics line. I got it at Ulta, and it does great things for my hair. So I definitely recommend that. And I also like the Aussie 3-Minute Miracle Conditioner. I've repurchased this. This is a great conditioner, and it's very inexpensive. Um, so that's definitely a great product too. And for skincare, you guys know that I really like the Michael Todd products. This one is the Rose Petal Mask. I believe all of his products are paraben free. And um, I think I'm going to do an updated skincare routine soon. So if you guys want to see that, just you know, leave a thumbs up or a comment. Um, but I have tried some more Michael Todd products since the review that I did like several months ago. So I, I think I'll do an updated routine and show you guys some other products from his line that I like. But these work great for my skin and they're paraben free. And then for, um, this is like the Rosebud Cell from Bath & Body Works. I use this on my lips as like a chapstick and I also use it on my nails as like a cuticle oil. And I find this to be really effective and this is a handy little product. And then for Makeup Bare Minerals, I believe everything from their line is paraben free. This is the like under eye brightener and well rested. And then this is just a little sample I got of the foundation. And I've used the foundation before and it's really excellent and uh, my mom uses it too so th this, they have some really great products from Bare Minerals my favorite eye, eye primer is the Lorac eye primer this is the second one of these I've had and I already have a backup of this um, I find that one area that I I've been having a really hard time finding paraben free products is particularly in eye products um, if you search it's not too hard to find like skincare or body care ones but for some reason, particularly in the eye products, I have problems. So this is a great eye primer. If that might save you a little bit of searching for a good eye primer, I love that one. And also, yeah, another eye product. This one's really cheap. This is like a drugstore gem I discovered this year. Is the Essence Gel Eyeliner. I'm pretty sure this is three bucks. And I got this at Ulta. I'm sure they have it a few other places too. But this like lasts all day, does not smudge. And I plan on buying this when this one runs out. And then Tarte is well known for being like more of a natural brand and a paraben free brand. These are their Amazonian clay blushes. You guys can tell these are like two of my favorites. This is um, Exposed and this one is Blissful and these are probably like my two very favorite br um, blushes. I have another one from Tarte too and these are excellent. Highly recommend Tarte. And I, um, Laura Geller, most of her products, sadly, I have found are not paraben-free, but one is her Real Deal Concealer, and I think this is an excellent concealer. 
And um, I am actually a little bit discouraged from buying more of her products right now since I, I found some other brands that I think are um, a lot better for your skin. But I'm still enjoying this concealer while I have it. And, and yeah, you know, it's in the list. This is one of her products in the good list. And um, Josie Marin is kind of hit and miss for me, but every product in her line is paraben free, I'm pretty sure. And this is her Argan Illuminizer. So this is a good little cheek highlighter. And then I also believe everything in the Cora's line is um, paraben free. And these are the lip butters. I've had a few of these. I really, really like these. Um, some other good brands you might want to look into is Burt's Bees. Um, that's excellent. And um, what else to tell you? Oh, um, somewhere that like ha how you search if a product has parabens in it or not is look at the ingredients on the back. So paraben is short for like methyl paraben, propyl paraben, there's a bunch of different ones. So just look on the ingredients on the back of your product and if you see anything paraben, that means it has parabens in it. And if I'm searching to buy a new product, I look online, just literally type into Sephora or Ulta online like in the search bar, type like paraben free and then it'll show you like all the products that are paraben free. And if, that might be overwhelming because there's a bunch of them. So you can like narrow it down, like search paraben free and then click on the left and search like face or like lips and then you can find all the products that are paraben free. So I find that to be really helpful and I hope this video was helpful for you. Take care guys and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.